heading to our normal our uh, normal breakfast spot for the weekends. Um, feels good to be back in Ottawa because we've been doing this for years. Bram sauce. Let's go. We're back. Good you? Good to be back. Hello. Nice sunny day. Wow. Wow. Just so popular. Who is this guy? <laughs> Everywhere we go. Where come from? Want to order? Do you want to order for us? <laughs> you want to? As I remember what everyone always orders. Oh, everyone <laughs> usually gets this one. Right? This is my breakfast platter <laughs> for me and all of my five children. <laughs> that there's like one little red pepper on it. I always eat about half of that from Shelby, so that's why I get a normal sized breakfast. <laughs> Just bite. There we go. Sorry, <laughs> paying off. Shelby, come on. Off to go get some film developed. Oh, okay. I feel so awesome to be walking down Bank Street on a beautiful spring day, going to all my favorite places, but I'm pretty sure literally no one else other than me gives a shit about how excited I am right now. I'm looking all that film. It's not even very much. I'm a crappy photographer. I should take it more than this. Wow. Maybe some really good photos coming soon. Hopefully. I'm excited, it's like Christmas. Mm. Alright, good to go. Uh, film has been dropped off, paper has been bought, artistic materials are acquired. Shelby is ready for Banff. What? Ready for Banff. in the van. Shelby is abandoning the van trip to take off to Banff. She's eating Cheetos. <laughs> she needs her comfort. She needs her comfort food because um, Shelby's a little stressed out. 
about moving to the mountains for a full month. If you remember our last time in Banff, it is quite cold there. Um, there's quite a lot of snow and everything is very expensive. So she'll be packed. packed how many it. bags? I packed everything. The thing is, like, I learned to be really simplistic living in the van. And, like, I don't eat a lot of stuff, but I had to bring all my art supplies. And that's And the groceries because I brought we're a little cheap. bit of food. So I have a large suitcase, a small suitcase, a backpack, and a camera bag. Which seems excessive, but most of it's not clothes. Most of it is stuff for making art. Art stuff. Oh, that's my seat? Okay. I don't understand why there's Air Canada here and Air Canada there. Everything is Air Canada, Shelby. You're in Canada, Canada. <laughs> Shelby, hashtag live with less. They took Shelby's overweight bags. Overweight bag. Yeah. At first, when they said on the scale it was like 70 pounds, and I was like, oh no. But then it like went down. So I have way too much stuff. I don't want to talk about it. I think it's really important to reiterate though that this was a art trip that Shelby's doing to a remote area, so she has to bring all her art supplies, extra food, all of her clothes for a month. She's not really packing that much. But the things are stressing me out. I've noticed now that things, the amount of things, stress me out now. Don't get stressed out. living in the van. It's just too much stuff. I just hate stuff. Okay. Say goodbye to you now. Goodbye. Have a nice time. Don't get to send me your last like this and that. I love you. Can I hug you? Bye, Shelby. Next up on the storage modifications, I used to have like this mesh elastic mess over uh, above the couch and it just drooped and hung in everyone's faces and you couldn't really sit at the couch because it was just in there around and just really obnoxious. So I bought this elastic band here and I'm using a few planks of wood and I'm building storage like this. So what it is basically was four elastic bands I go all the way across, they're pulled just barely taut here, and then I've got them stapled and glued on the back side of these planks right here. And then these planks are screwed into the beam behind. Simple enough. See how it works. Okay. Second batch has been installed. Holding some cups and stuff like that. Does a pretty good job. Lights on. There you go. Elastic storage. That's pretty easy. The nice thing is it really holds it tight against the wall so it doesn't overhang and get in this vertical space because that vertical space is very critical.